It's one of the largest free concert series on the Central Coast, and for the past 28 years, it's captivated audiences from around the area. I'm Dylan Foreman, your community reporter in San Luis Obispo, where here at Mission Plaza, the event has wide-reaching impacts every Friday evening. Packed with people <laughs> and great music, Concerts in the Plaza is having its most popular year since the COVID-19 pandemic. We're really excited to just keep seeing that growth year over year. According to Maggie Kovac with Downtown Slow, as of last Friday, attendance over the last 10 concerts has totaled 40,000 people with an average of three to 4,000 people every week. We really try to make it a destination for people, whether that's locals or tourists, but also um, people like to come here because they like to come downtown. And businesses in the surrounding area are getting a boost from the crowds that flock to the Mission Plaza over the three month period. In here, we have definitely seen an increased sale of just like glasses um, and then of course for all of the bottle purchases for down below. Region Wine Bar was the wine sponsor this year and saw an opportunity to offer a pre-show happy hour as well as an area for people to come after the concert wraps up. So people don't have to, you know, leave downtown or drive somewhere else. They can kind of just like walk right on over over here. Slow Cider co-owner Nate Adamski is another partner with the Summer Concert Series and says his company reaps the benefits. It helps us out a lot during the summer, yeah, because there is kind of a dip in terms of the Cal Poly kids leaving, so it's, it's things like this um, that help kind of bridge that gap for us during the summer. After almost 30 years of this event, it takes a village. Kovac says that between 30 and 40 people are responsible for putting on the concert each and every Friday. All the people that run the beverage stations are volunteers, and the people that set up the stage from Bill Gaines Audio start their day at 10.30 a.m. working a full 12-hour shift. It's the collective efforts that create the entertainment. Community aspect to uh, what we do here, uh, that I think it really just draws people in. The Summer Concert Series wraps up next Friday, September 6th with a performance from Dante Marsh and the Vibe Setters. If you'd like me to look into a story, you can reach me at the QR code, email, or phone number on your screen. In San Luis Obispo, I'm Dylan Foreman, KSBY News.